All right, y'all. So what's up? I'm back, right? I'm back with another Teen Talk episode. And today's episode, we're bowling. Well, they're bowling. I'm not bowling. I'm not bowling. I don't like bowling. I'll tell y'all about that later, but I don't like bowling. But yeah, we're linking up at a bowling alley. Um, and today, I'm going to bring the questions back. I already got a topic. I already planned out, mapped out what I'm asking. And the topic of the day is going to be... Oh, it's going to be book smart versus street smart. So I'm gonna ask you some questions based around those that topic. Whether you know their opinion or views on book smart, street smart, what they feel is more, you know, valuable, sustainable, whichever you know, around based around that. So that's our topic today. So I'm pretty much waiting for them to get here, and then I'm gonna take y'all inside, and we're gonna get started. I'm gonna start asking them questions, doing stuff like that, and let y'all see who win the bowling game. We're gonna go from there. So once they get here, I pull the camera back out and. My life's like a movie, so sit back and enjoy the view. I'm about to do some things that you thought I could never do. I'm really on a mission to make all the dreams come true. I'll never let nobody tell you what you cannot do. Y'all check out BB Draw. Y'all BB Draw, tell us stop playing. Got the easy zone. Tell us stop playing with you, BB. Tell us stop playing. Had the broken finger. BB gonna lose. <laughs> Brian, you know how to bowl? What the? Chanez. Chanez, why you acting all, all quiet and stuff? I feel some type of way. Oh, I'm sorry. Chanez, why'd you put it? <laughs> I'm gonna give it right back. I gotta take you home. How much you put in? I'll put it right. Give it right it's back. It's thirty dollars. Why are you give me thirty dollars? I just paid for everybody. No, it's to bowl. twenty dollars. Why? Who? Because who? twenty for me and Naya, and then ten for me each of them. Didn't I just tell y'all? I just paid for everybody. Bowl. Oh, Why y'all still giving me money? Huh? Oh. Oh. Feel bad. Why y'all feel bad? It's okay. It's not. It right. has to be said off camera. Oh, no, it's okay. Okay. Wait, what? 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 Okay, it's gonna have to be said off camera. No, it does not. It doesn't have to be said at all, to be honest. Did I tell you the camera was gonna be out, Lexus? I told you the camera was gonna be out. All right, all right. They want us to cut the cameras, y'all. We'll be back. All right, y'all. We about to vote. Go ahead, put the star. Put the name on them. All right, y'all. We about to start. Okay. Me and Brianna is not bowling. Get ready, y'all. It takes them ten years to put their bowling shoes on. Bibi, you think you're gonna win? Brian, you think you're gonna win? I'm definitely gonna win. Like, that's not. Now, you think you're gonna win? No. <laughs> you think you're gonna win? Do that? Oh my god, where's the confidence? Where's the self confidence? That's it, you think you're gonna win? Oh, it's three. So who know how to bowl? Y'all just put the three Googles over here and then 
and the four Tosos over there. I'm saying it'll be it'll be competitive. Like the ones who get really bold, it'll be fair. No? Okay. They don't want to listen to me, y'all. They doing their own thing. Whatever. I'm just and then as soon as I disappear, they're gonna be like, oh, where did Shelby go? But nobody's clearly paying me no attention. Stevie up first. Uh oh. Uh oh. Stevie. Oh my God, baby. What was that? All right, Lexus. Okay, 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 let's get bold a little bit. I don't even do this, dog. <laughs> 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 Stevie, 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 Oh my gosh, Nash. All right, Brian, you up. Let's go. Let's see what Brian working with. Okay. Brian can blow. Shanaz, let's go. All right, Brian, you got You got one more. Shanaz, go ahead. I got you too. Okay, y'all. Okay. Okay. All right, Brian, you got one more. Oh, it's, it's all right, you did good, you only had one. All right, Nubia, you're up, Nubia. All right, who else, Nubia and Anaya. All right, Nubia. Oh, it's okay, Nubia. Let's try again. Let's try again. All right, Anaya. Night, Anaya. What? Yeah, yeah. yeah. they trying. They trying. All right, Nubia. You got this, Nubia. There we go. There we go. Almost, Nubia. It's okay. All right, Anaya. Anaya's is the ball. Anaya. What happened? What happened? What happened? <laughs> All right, y'all, check the scope. Those are two scores right there, y'all. Team one and team two. Yeah. Okay, so what would you define as being street smart? Um, I define being street smart like knowing the in and outs about the street, like knowing where, what is, knowing what game hangs out where. It's just kind of like being aware of your surroundings and knowing what to do at what time when you're in the street or like knowing like just specific things like maybe like who is what and knowing what to do what to wear and yeah what would you define as book smart book smart is knowing like pretty much kind of like me <laughs> a know-it-all you know facts that most people wouldn't really know about different books different things it can be history it can be math just like being in your book knowing things that necessarily don't have to deal with the outside world, but has to do that you only know by studying. Okay, in today's society, which one do you think would be more sustainable? Oh, I think being book smart would be more sustainable because when you learn about history and you learn about what happened, we're in the future, so it helps us like stop, like it helps us pick up the tracks of what our ancestors didn't know. And so we can stop it happening before like history repeats itself. Okay, so which one would you identify yourself with? Being book smart, would you say you're more book smart or you're more street smart? I'm definitely more book smart. I don't know nothing about the streets. <laughs> okay. I don't know nothing about the streets. Okay. I know more about books and history and that type of stuff than I know about Quran and I live in Quran. <laughs> okay. Okay. What would you define as being book smart? I would define being book smart as like being smart in school. So not necessarily like enjoying reading books and knowing how to read like big, big, big books. But like being able to just like be in the books and study textbooks and like be able to like do good on tests and stuff. Like that's what I consider 
I guess. I don't think I know Okay. What would you consider being street smart ass? <laughs> um, I would honestly consider being street smart as like being, like being social, like being able to talk to people, being able to know your words, you know your way around the knees. Just like know your way into clicks and stuff, just navigating people, knowing how to talk to people. Like that's street smart. It's not necessarily like being a gangster or anything like that. It's just knowing how to talk to people. Okay. Which one do you think is more sustainable in today's society? Being book smart or being street smart? Honestly, street smart because there's a lot of things you could do in life and like to be successful without like being book smart, like without graduating college and stuff. Still go to college if you want to, but I'm saying like there's a lot you can do if you know how to not like if you have street smart and you know how to navigate the world and like how to talk to people, then like you could find your way to being successful without necessarily being book smart. I think she's my okay. Which do you identify yourself as? Being book smart, being street smart, or both? I say both, to be honest. I have a healthy balance. Like, I'm good in school. I'm good with the books, but at the same time, I'm very social. I know how to communicate with people. So I say I'm good in both. And I mean, either one, depending on the situation I'm in. Okay. Okay. How would you define being book smart? Going to school. Going to school. Um, yeah, going to school, doing your work. That's book smart, by the way. Yeah, I'm gonna do it like that. Going to school. Okay. Right okay, how would you define being street smart? Now, that's another thing. Street smart, um, it's a lot of different ways you could define that. One of them is like how you could carry yourself in the street, don't get tried by somebody. Carry, you got respect for somebody, or uh, they know somebody gonna have respect for you. That could go both ways, book smart and street smart. Yeah, that, I do. Okay, so, okay, so, next question. Oh, and Street Smart's gonna get you that money, I'm telling you. Book oh, Smart to get you that, it just takes longer. All right, listen, listen to this question now. Okay, in today's society, which one do you think is more sustain sustainable? Street okay. Smart. Street Smart? I think Street Smart, is because I feel like Street Smart is... Book smart, they don't teach you a lot of stuff how the streets gonna teach you. The streets gonna teach you how to rule, how to be smooth. The book smart, they don't teach you uh, like a minimum of stuff. They don't teach you everything you gotta know. They don't teach you your history about the police. The Ten Amendment, a Ten Amendment, that's about everything. You don't need to know a lot more stuff than that. It's a lot you gotta know. So the, the, I feel like the streets can teach you a lot, and they can gotta make them bad. You already know. Okay. Last question. Yeah. Which one would you define yourself as being? You, you think you book smart or you street smart or you both? I'm both. I can do all. I can do it all. I'm street smart, book smart, football smart, all that. I can do it all. I'm all just right. that type of person. I can do it all, y'all. Hey, stay tuned. We got more people going. Okay. <laughs> what do you think is more sustainable in today's society? Being book smart or being street smart? Book smart. Book smart. Street smart. You know what Okay, who wanna? What about you? Well, what's book smart? Book, book smart? smart. Book smart. What about you? I said street smart. Street smart? Yeah. What you say? Book smart. Street smart? Book. Book. Street smart. Street smart. Street smart. Y'all tripping like y'all play the streets or something. What you gonna What you gonna learn in the books? For real, man. You, if you read a book, you ain't gonna use it for like. What you gonna give me the streets? Death? What you gonna give me? No. You ain't gonna use it. I promise you not gonna. You ain't gonna use it. Nah. Okay, so which ones would y'all say y'all is? Y'all say y'all more street smart or book smart or both? Like y'all can. I'm a little bit of both. I'm more street smart. Street smart. Street smart. Yeah, you said a little bit of both? Yeah, I'm a little bit of both. I'm, I'm more street smart than anything. Okay, so two more questions. The first one is, what would y'all define as being street smart? Like, what, if somebody say I'm street, like, what is that? I guess knowing how to, like, move around the streets and know what to do. Yeah. And keep yourself yeah. so straight. Yeah, just, just like... Yeah, just just standing your ground, really. Just playing it, playing the streets. <laughs> just standing your ground. Okay. And then what would y'all define as being book smart? Just really hitting the books. Just the books. Nah, just hitting the books. That's it. You know, it's it. College, really. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's really just hitting the books. That's Get in a degree. Okay. Well, I appreciate y'all. Y'all, this is a group of a group of teenagers out here. At Showbiz, and I just ran a little ass them the questions. And they was down to answer with me. Okay. Like, 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 okay. So y'all wanna like introduce y'all stuff, show y'all, you know, y'all Instagram, Facebook, so people can like. Yeah, follow me on Instagram, at the account underscore me, boy. Y'all call them on Instagram, anybody else y'all wanna look? Nah, I'm good. Y'all good? All right, well thank y'all. No problem. So, what do you think being street smart is? Street smart, you know, street like, you don't got, you don't got to be a street smart, you know, you don't got to be a street smart, 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 you don't got to be a street smart
you know, no snitching nothing. Like, you gotta know the code. Okay. To your hood. Okay. What you think being street smart is? Street smart, being out of games. Don't tell on your bro. Stay low. Okay. Okay. And then what would you, what would y'all define as being book smart? Book smart. Staying in school, going to college, and making the future for yourself. Okay. And what about you? Get, get your education. Go where you want to be. And that's it. Okay. Last question. So, what would you define yourself as? Being street smart, book smart, or both? Both. Both? How oh, about you? You both. You both? Okay. Well, I appreciate y'all. Y'all want to give y'all some a shout out to our Instagram. Tell people to follow y'all on Facebook. Shout out Foreign Kid with 2Ds underscore JP. All right, y'all. Foreign Kid. Touch money underscore dot G3. All right. Give it your move. Like street smart is. Like, y'all know what street smart is? Street? Street, yeah. street, street smart. Pretty much, pretty much. Yeah. Like what we defined it as? Yeah, like what y'all think they should do. It's scary, y'all. It's cool. It's cool. This is my last question. This is my question. How old you are? Baby, no, don't answer that. How old you are? People don't know how old I am. You doing too much. Y'all don't answer him. She's lost. Yeah, yeah, we'll cut that out. We'll cut that out. I ain't gonna tell them, tell them about your age. Everybody know y'all teenagers. Cause it's like, it's called teen talk. So, it'll be on there. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be on there. Cause you got, I won't put the portions, but I can't. What's our YouTube? Shelby PD. Shelby S-H-E-L-B-Y. Yeah, the part be on that like the bar. It'll be on that the bar, so y'all stay tuned. It'll be on that the bar. I gotta like cut and stuff. No, 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 like you know, like you know, if you do that, start that hand on that, you keep your eye on it. Like you don't put them in the start, watch them see how it plays out. Okay. Like that. Okay. So, what would you find as being book smart? Book smart. Yeah, being book smart. You don't gotta be like I'm smart, as long as you like study a little bit, and don't be studying smart. Okay. You know, dumb. Okay, but like in today's society, which one would you say is more sustainable? Sustainable, being book smart or being street smart, or both? I say wise. Wise. Yeah. That's good. And then, what would you identify yourself as? Street smart, book smart, or both? I say both. Both. Okay, that's good. We appreciate you. Thank you for answering. What's your Instagram? Oh yeah, shout your Instagram yourself. underscore C H I R. I M O T O. All right, yeah, y'all follow that, but that'll be real, yeah. So, what would you define as being book smart? Just having knowledge in things like in school, like you know. Okay, so what would you, what would you say is more sustainable? Just having knowledge in things like in school, like you know. Okay, so what would you, what would you say is more sustainable in today's society? Being book smart, street smart, or being both? I think they both play a big part in your life, but I think I'm gonna say both because I don't think one outweighs the other. Okay. The definition of being. How would you define being book smart? Like able to recite something that you just learned from a book, not having any knowledge of stuff that goes on outside. Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, what's your definition of being street smart? Being street smart? The opposite of being book smart. You don't know, you really know anything from a book. You learn everything to you know from just living life. Book smart is, I think, like that just uh, being good in school. But, like, I mean, it's it not being good in school, but like, you know, being able to. Excel in school, I guess. Yeah, that like reading off of a book and retaining that information. But street smarts is is exactly that. You on the streets and then you got like you pick things up like that. You won't learn. You can't read that in a book. You're not gonna read street smarts in a book because you that's something you like learn through like. Okay. So, so that's the, I think that's. Good. So what would you define yourself as? More street smart, book smart, or both? Um, uh, I got a good balance. 
I you got a good balance? I think I, I got a good mix, a good blend. You got a good blend? I think it's always good to have both. To have both? Street smarts gets you through life, but book smarts gets you like, like through like financially. Okay. Unless you got no idea, so that's street smart. I don't. <laughs> that was good. I like that. I like that. All right, y'all. We had red losses. Now we about to eat. Nah, no. Wait, everybody else. Oh. Oh, that's you. You be. That's you being rude. That's just we be. We being rude. All right, y'all. So we have red losses. Clearly, I don't know what everybody else is, but it's only Bibi, Shanice, and me, and everybody else. Clearly, does not want to eat, but we're starving. We're at Red Lobsters. All right, y'all. So that's the wrap. That's the end of the video for today. So as y'all see, the video got a little, you know mixed up because bb started going to being very social and asked some other teenagers if they wanted to be a part of what we was doing so y'all to see that inside the video <laughs> anyway that's most definitely rap we ended up at sonic because red lobster had a very long wait no, they did. Oh, yeah. red lobster had a very long wait that's my story and i'm sticking to it yeah all right hey y'all <laughs> Back on the channel for the one time. They went out with me twice. They went out without me twice. It's all good. That is your own fault. You know what I'm saying? We're recovering. We back on the road. You feel me? I don't know how many more get togethers we're gonna have before I go off to college. You know what I'm saying? I'm sorry, I gotta lead a little crew. Lead a little crew. You know, I love them. I love love them with all my heart. No, you don't. Me and me and my uh my friend. Nice. <laughs> we're out here with Shelby and BB. Yeah, in the back. Uh-huh. Yep. Um this is the end of her vlog. We had a good day today. I was saying no, we, had we did not. We had a no. good time at no, showbiz. Let me say I thought we did. But one thing about it, y'all, when I first got with them today, I ain't even gonna vlog. Like that energy was really on. Like Shanae was very quiet. Lex was just staring at me like she had something that she wanted to say. Everybody was doing their own work. So I don't know what was going on today. I don't know if they missed me. They just ain't know how to say it, but. That energy was most definitely off, and I'm just, um, hopefully next time everybody have better energy. So everybody's watching this video, I hope next time we all keep cut by y'all, and we can have better energy. Just Thank cut. Just all right, we're going to go ahead. That's a wrap. You know, BB going to go ahead and close his house. <laughs> I'm in the camera so bad. Wait. Let me see. I'm going to hold it. Oh. He want to get his little stardom. She want to He's what it's about him. But now I do feel all this how I do it all, y'all. I'm back on the channel more often, but anyway, we're going to turn up more often. Um, yeah, move back to the condo. We got it. <laughs>